What's going on guys? Masquerade Cinephile here with you. I uh, want to do a quick video. Just got some posters in. Um, yeah, I've been buying quite a few posters. Been finding some decent deals. Some not not too great deals, but still posters I've always wanted. And so I've been pulling the trigger on them. And uh, right here, first up, you got uh, Visiting Hours. Just that awesome, so frightening, you'll never recover. Yes, the hospital emergency room, and you can see the lights are all lit up in the shape of a skull. Just badass artwork. Yeah. Starring uh, Michael Ironside, who uh, I will be meeting at uh, Texas Frightmare Weekend uh, next month. So probably going to get this signed. I think that'd be really cool. And I have a scanner's poster that I'm definitely going to get signed by him. So, but yeah, very cool visiting hours. If you haven't seen it, you know, it's been what, like 40 years, so I'll just blow it for you. But Michael Ironside is the killer in the movie. Like, you know, he always plays the bad guy, so. But yeah, very cool. So, moving on to the next. And this is Prom Night 2. Hello, Mary Lou. So, this is another one that I grew up watching a lot. I would always rent. Uh, totally different from the original Prom Night. Uh, got some more supernatural vibe to it. But yeah, love that poster. Mary Lou wants to be prom queen, even if it kills her again. Very cool. You can see all the names and stuff on the lockers carved in there. But yeah, just great artwork, a great movie. And also, by coincidence... Michael Ironside is in this film as well. And they just announced um, for Texas Frightmare Weekend that the actress who played Mary Lou, I can't remember her name right now. Um, I'm sure it's on here somewhere. But uh, I think it's Lisa Shrage? Shrage? I don't know how you pronounce it. But uh, she will be doing her first ever U.S. convention. And she will be at Texas Frightmare Weekend. So this one's definitely going with me to get double signed. So. But yeah. Very cool. Alright, let's move on. And this is from 1987. Yeah, I saw this one pop up. And I paid more than I should have for this one. But I love the... The zombies rising out of the water. And uh, I've never seen the movie. So. But uh, that movie is Shockwaves. The Deep End of Horror. Peter Cushing. John Carradine. But yeah. I love the, the image. Um, so when I saw it pop up. I was like yeah I got a bit on it. <laughs> and I did end up winning it. I paid more than I wanted to. But you know how that goes guys. Once they were almost human. Beneath the living beyond the dead from the depths of hell's ocean very cool stuff yeah all right and this one's not in the best condition you can tell it's had tape put on it uh, just there's a tear up at the very top corner looks like someone like wrote on it a little bit here but what do you expect man this movie is uh from what like i don't see a year on it but i know it's from the 70s so this thing has definitely seen the rounds, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, yeah, had to have it. Plan on uh, putting this in a frame. And you won't even notice all that stuff. So, And it's a very thin paper, very thin. So let's move this one over carefully. And we got one last one. And that is Berserker. So, yeah. From 1987... Very cool slasher, supernatural type deal when people out in the woods camping and shit. And you know how that always goes in a horror movie, so. But yeah, I love that painted part up top. You see the campers there. Cool stuff, man. It's too late to run. There's no time to scream. Just close your eyes and pray to die. Really good. But yeah, 
just a quick uh, I got I just got these in uh, all last week so I just want to do a video and let you guys see them yeah I'm definitely heavily back into collecting posters I didn't think I would be but like I said I've been finding some pretty good deals um, some not so much like the shockwave one but I had to have that one and uh, there's just some posters that you're gonna pay a lot for if you want them and you want you know you really want them that bad you're just gonna have to pay a lot for them Unless they're in like a really, really horrible condition. So, yeah. But uh, that'll do it, guys, for this uh, video. Um, believe it or not, I got more posters coming in. So, I wouldn't... Probably sometime next week, I'll have another poster video up, guys. So, um, yeah. Stay tuned for more videos, guys. And uh, I'll see you when I see you. Later.